Hi, my name is Steven Gomez. I am the product trainer here at Luxly. I'm also a photographer based out of New York City. Today we're going to be talking about the Luxly Cello Mark II. The Cello Mark II is an on-camera 10-inch LED RGBAW light and it really offers some of the best color that you can find uh, on the market today. As you can see behind me, we have them on color cycle and they're producing these nice rich colored tones. Uh, along with just regular RGB, you have a full set of gels and we're gonna be talking today about how you can use the Cello Mark II to unlock your creativity when doing photo and video. So our first creative use is going to be doing portraits, right? And portraits, you can be really creative with the Cello Mark II. Like I said, it has tons of colors, RGB modes, uh, HSI, uh, gel modes. So we really want to take advantage of that because the Cello Mark II uh, is using five die LED technology and it's RGBAW. We really want to take advantage of what that has to offer. So we're actually going to be shooting a, a friend of mine, uh, Justin. He's going to, we're going to be doing a color split, which is very popular, very common. And it's a great way to create some emotion, evoke some feelings out of an image. And uh, basically the way we go about it is we're going to go ahead and we're going to set up uh, the Cello Mark IIs. We have three of them, uh, but for this shot we're actually going to only use two because we want a, a very defined color palette. We're going to go with red and blue and we're going to use the blue uh, on the left and red on the right and we're going to kind of have it create this kind of good and bad kind of uh, emotion from those two colors. So while we're shooting we're going to go ahead and we're going to kind of play with um, where the light's positioned. We're going to go through all the colors kind of just to see what works best even though our initial idea is red and blue. Uh, so when you're using the different colors, you have such a wide range of things that you can kind of bring out of the subject or kind of put into the photo or video, right? So if you're using really bright, airy colors, you can really create a kind of uh, open, open sense of um, like almost like safety or uh, pleasantness. Uh, if you're going with a more punchier, darker, um, dramatic colors, you're going to invoke a lot of drama, a lot of uh, maybe mystery. And these are components that you can put together when doing your photo or your video to kind of add another layer of dimension, another layer of storytelling to your photo and your overall creative process. Oh, yes. <laughs> that is, that's sick. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna use the Cello Mark IIs for product photography. And again, we're gonna experiment a little bit with uh, using standard daylight or tungsten to kind of, you know, your more traditional look of lighting uh, a product, uh, or we're gonna go with, try some RGB and also see if we can add some flare. We're gonna be using three lights, so we do have plenty of options, right? So we're gonna see if we can add some color to the background, maybe add some color to the bottle, because uh, we are gonna be shooting a wine bottle and uh, those are always fun to shoot. Get those nice long highlights, uh, and the Cello Mark IIs are going to be are, are perfect for this because of their size and their shape. They're 10 inches long, so they lend very well to creating very long highlights. And you know, as we're using them on C stands, we're going to have the ability to kind of position them however we need to to get our perfect and our ideal highlights. So the Cello Mark II offers a wide range of features that I think put it above a lot of other options, especially like more traditional, just standard daylight uh, LEDs. Uh, but other things is uh, we have the ability uh, to be controlled wirelessly with our, uh, with our app. The app is full featured. You can literally just stay at the camera behind the tripod, control all the lights from your phone and have complete control over what the light's doing. Uh, it really makes it easy, especially if you're doing things that are uh, more complex, like if you're compositing, where you don't want to touch anything, you don't want to move anything because things won't line up. Uh, that feature alone in the Cello Mark II, I think, makes it extremely valuable. Um, also, just the, the accurate uh, CRI and TLCI of the Cello Mark II coming in at 97 and 98 uh, means that you're not, you're not going to have any issues in post-production when it comes to your color. Your color is going to be accurate. It's going to be spot on. The next thing we're going to talk about is something that I think we've all kind of... Uh, experience in the last couple of years and that's work from home. So yes, the Cello Mark IIs are great for photography and videography of all kinds, professional, amateur content creation, all those great things. But also one of the things that I think is uh, overlooked a lot is the fact that it makes a great uh, work from home light, right? So like a lot of us uh, during the last couple of years, we've had to take meetings from home, virtual meetings, Zoom seminars, what have you. And there's nothing worse than being on camera and being in a dark room and nobody can really see you, right? A lot of people think it's all about the webcam, Really, a lot of it's the lighting. If you have a good quality light lighting you while you're working, it's gonna make the video image way better. It's gonna look way more high definition. And again, if you were so inclined to get creative, you could add some color to it, but with just a basic daylight or tungsten light setting, you're gonna look fantastic for your next Zoom meeting. 
So one of the things that really makes the Cello 2 so cool is the fact that not only is it a small, uh, powerful light, but that it can be used on and off camera. As you see behind me, I have the uh, Cello Mark 2s on C-stands in a studio environment, yeah, which just looks a little weird because they're so small, but what's great is that I can pop it onto a camera and I can do on-the-go vlogging. Now, in the last couple of years, we've seen the vlogging uh, situation explode on, on places like YouTube. Uh, you have some people creating content every single day and there's nothing worse than traveling around with your camera and then all of a sudden you're in a shaded area or the sun goes away because of the clouds and now you can't, you have to change your exposure and it's all messed up. And if you have the Chilla Mark II on the camera, you can just turn it on, give yourself a little front fill and you're gonna look fantastic for your next outing when you're vlogging. And finally, the Cello Mark II makes a great accent light. Whether you're a filmmaker on their first production, if you're in a tight space like a car and you need to add some color, some pop, or if you're a Twitch streamer and you're streaming from home and you just wanna add a little pizzazz to your setup, throw a Cello Mark II against the wall, put on your favorite color, and you're gonna add a lot of character to your next broadcast. Thanks so much for joining me today. I really appreciate you all being here. I hope you've learned a little bit of something about the Cello Mark II, and I hope you found these tips useful. Uh, feel free to check out bnhfilter.com. They carry the full line of Luxie products. Let us know what you think about the product. Let us know what you're using. Uh, tag us on social media. And if you have any more questions about Luxie, please feel free to contact us. I am more than happy to uh, help you out. Uh, thanks again, and we'll see you soon.